Hi, everyone, and welcome to a new episode of Asset Tracking Transformations with Dimly. I'm excited to introduce today's guest, your score from Vilka. Vilka is a full service provider and supplier of everything rail construction, from track lane to welding to overhead line construction and more. Joost, welcome to the show. Hi. Hi. Joost, can I start off by asking you what you do at Wilke? Um, yes, I am the head of digitalization for the whole Wilke group. And in your own words, what does Wilke do? Um, Wilke is a medium-sized full-service provider in railway construction. We offer everything from surveying to foundations, uh, track laying, welding, overhead line construction, large-scale machinery and track-bound logistics. A quite an operation which I can imagine comes with quite a few asset tracking challenges. So what were the issues you were encountering when you came to Tim Lee? Um, well, our problem was uh, that um, our asset tracking was spread out between uh, different systems. So some parts were done in our ERP system, others relied on Excel spreadsheets, um, saved on network drives and the knowledge of key personnel. Um, and yeah, ERP licenses are expensive. The systems are powerful, but often hard to learn and, and to use. Spreadsheets on network drives are prone to errors. Um, personnel is a bottleneck resource. So we wanted a system that is focused on asset tracking, uh, easy to learn, easy to use, um, and that can be accessed by anyone who needs information at like almost any time from almost anywhere. Mm, so I assume you replaced Excel with our app in the cloud, were you able to replace any other systems or maybe integrate them with Dimly? Um, we currently work on integrating it, it replaced some parts, um, but we want to or we, we want the systems to communicate so that we can um, pass the data that we have in Dimly uh, through to our ERP system. Yeah, that definitely sounds sensible. Um, what specifically made you choose Dimly though as a solution? Um, we chose it because the combination of its focus on asset tracking, the usability and the price. Um, Timly stands out from other solutions due to its excellent usability, um, the very fast and uncomplicated support, and it has a very powerful and well-documented API. And um, yeah, that was or that were the, the key facts for us um, to choose Timly over other solutions. Yeah, all really great reasons. Um, and I'm really pleased you mentioned ease of use, especially because you've been using Timly for quite a while now, haven't you? Um, we've been using it for almost two and a half years now. Almost two and a half years, and we certainly hope many more to come. Uh, what were the biggest improvements you saw or you've seen during this time? Um, we made the greatest improvements in terms of transparency. Um, our asset tracking is still not perfect, but Timly has made it much easier to identify potential for improvement and to identify potential problems at an early stage. Yeah, it's also like a learning process, isn't it? Um, so what would you say have been the most helpful features for your specific use case? Um, yes, the deadline and qualification overviews, uh, because they make it extremely easy to monitor expiring deadlines, expiring qualifications, um, to schedule maintenance, inspection measures and, and training courses um, way before they are due. Um, and we can provide managers with um, all the information they need on the current status um, in a really simple and summarized form. Mm, yeah, all really important capabilities, especially in your sector where compliance is a big issue. Um, would you say that any of these features were a surprise at all? Um, the features themselves, not really, but the customization possibilities and the, yeah, as I have to say, excellent usability despite the extensive uh, functionalities and, and basically all parts of the software. That was a surprise. A high level of customization is of use. I definitely always cited by our customers. Um, these are the positives. Were there perhaps any things that didn't work as expected or has Timly not delivered in some areas as you might have wished it to? Well, we have a few minor bugs from time to time, but there was nothing serious um, so far. Um, and yeah, everything we, we reported was solved in a really short time. So 
um, we don't have or we didn't have really big problems, like some small inconveniences, but nothing serious. Yeah, our customer success team and our product development team will definitely be very happy to hear this because like being responsive like that is definitely one of the um, goals we've we've set ourselves. If you were to recommend Tim Lee for one reason, what would that reason be? Because Tim Lee makes it very easy to start small uh, and then yeah, gradually create the prerequisites um, to use additional functions, additional features, um, and increase the quality of asset uh, tracking step by step without overwhelming the involved people. Yes, yeah, so important to have an app that can scale with you as your needs change. Um, Joost, why do you like working with Tim Lee? Because it is so uncomplicated. That's great. And my last question, although I can probably guess the answer to it, if you had to sum up your experience with Tim Lee in just one word, what would that be? Yeah, that is that would be uncomplicated. Yours, that's all of my questions. It's been great speaking with you. Um, before we let you go, is there anything else you would like to add? Um, well, I enjoyed the cooperation and you mentioned the uh, development team. They are really great. They they have a really fast response time. I don't remember any other software where where I had such good contacts to the development team and uh, that response time. That's really great to hear. I'll make sure I'll pass it on. Joost, thank you ever so much for your time. And I certainly hope to see you back on the show at some point. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Everyone, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed the conversation with Joost. To find out more about Volker, make sure to check out the links in the description box underneath or above this video. Follow or subscribe for more content like this. And I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, happy tracking. Bye, everyone.